On the surface, UNK tennis players Zanel Turabek, Treng Tran, and Anastasia Kuzovanova look like your ordinary UNK student athletes, but they are far from it. They gave up their lives in their home countries to have an opportunity to continue playing the sport they love. So, I was playing professionally and I wanted to get into the professional circuit uh, in tennis and at the age of 16 I faced uh, an injury and that's when I was told that I probably won't be able to make it to the professional circuit. But when I was finishing off school, my plan was to go to college in England because my school was British, so it was kind of logical to do that. But then I realized that I'm going to lose tennis and lose the, you know, the ability to play tennis on the same level as I practiced before to be a professional. So I realized that if you go to college in the U.S., they provide you an opportunity to play tennis on like a really high level as well as combining education. So that was like a number one reason for me to come to U.S. in the first place. Okay, so my brother already did college tennis, like he is also from Germany and like he played college tennis for four years and he told me about how amazing it is. Like he played in a different state, in a different school, but still D2 and he said that's a really good opportunity to combine like education and sports, which I really love, like I love tennis and I still want to have a good education for my future because I know in the beginning I'm not going to be like the professionals, like the top ranking in the world, tennis players obviously. So I was like, yeah, I might just try that because it seems really awesome and it's a great opportunity to have this because not many other, like not many German people can say, oh yeah, I studied in America for four years and combine tennis with it. Zanel Turbek is from Kazakhstan and Central Asia. She is a returning starter at the number one and number two singles. One of the hardest things for Turbek coming to the United States was the language barrier. Kind of culture shock because of because of language, I guess. Because mm -hmm. you know, I I speak two more languages. Like my first language is Kazakh and Russian, and then I learned English um, like five years ago. And then it was really hard to like understand people at first, and uh, like, cause uh, in my country uh, when I was learning uh, English, it was like easier, cause teacher maybe like talk real like you know slow. But here when I came, I was like, oh my gosh, I don't understand anything. Is it like English language, you know? Mm -hmm. And also we learn like British English, not uh, American English. It's kind of like different. Trang Tran hails from Leipzig, Germany. She is one of five freshmen on the tennis team this year. When coming to Nebraska, one of the hardest things to deal with was the size of Kearney. Leipzig has a population of 504,971, compared to Kearney with a population of 33,835. Talk about a culture shock. Nebraska is a cold state. I don't want to say anything, but... I'm mostly a city girl, like I grew up in a it's kind fun. of a big yeah. city and it's a big change for me to go to Crony, which is a small town for me. Like people are so nice here, that's the big, like the main difference, like they are so nice and friendly and Germans are so direct, like they are, go if they don't like you they're gonna say straight into your fa uh, face, they don't like you, like that's obviously something different. Anastasia Kuzovanova is from Prague, Czech Republic. Before coming to UNK, she played two years at Division I Nichols State in Louisiana. Kuzovanova believes her upbringing prepared her to move far away from home and be independent. Well, I feel like for other international students, it's a lot more difficult. And I know from my experience of like meeting other internationals that they would cry themselves to sleep because they miss their family at home so much. But um, ever since I was 12, my parents would constantly be moving from Russia and like Europe and I lived in Europe mainly so I had to stay home alone for months to wait for them to come back because they had their work in Russia and I was living in Prague. So I got used to being alone without my parents. Even though Turabek, Tran and Kuzvanova's stories are all different, each of them look at the UNK tennis team as their family away from their home. Uh, love my team, tennis team, they're the best and um, also my coach, 
Scott Schaffer. Mm -hmm. <laughs> he's, uh, yeah, he's amazing. He really care about us, and not only as a coach, but also like, he's like my second father, I could say. The Loper tennis season is still young as they battle through their non-conference schedule. For the Antelope, I'm Alex Elder.